of classic action. Sure, Lauren Williams delighted with her gold. Zhu Linfang, former Chinese athlete and now referee, so she knows her way around the mat. Three times, two minutes. And Jade Jones, well, oh, she's so confident she doesn't even need a gum shield. <laughs> I'll just, I was just about to say I like the way she ran into being very confident, being there first, and then she's had to go back and get the gum shield. <laughs> so. She's ready though, she looks ready, they both look ready and very excited to be in this semi-final. Well, the silence gives way to the storm, Jade Jones straight in with a big push kick, tries to flick one upstairs straight away. Kuda Shova, no slouch herself, both in that close stance, but the push kick of Jade changing up nicely, Sarah. Yeah, she's well up for this match. You can see straight away, a few body shots, a few head shots, just kind of warning Kuda Shoulder off there. Love the little push kick there and the crowd loving it. Yeah, she was trying there to score the push and she's got it there now. Very good in the clinch from Jay Jones there. Well, you can hear the atmosphere, everyone really loving this. Jay Jones doubles up her score, thought about a headshot. Lovely response from Kudashova. To be honest for me, Kudashova was holding there before the headshot. And Jay Jones intimated that to the coach there, but the coach deciding not to play it. So Kudashova has the merest of advantage halfway through the first round. Jay's still keeping the pressure on there. Almost as if it was a start again. Okay, let's start again. Let me put the pressure back on. Let me use my stabbing kick as what she likes to do a lot to the body, then take it high. And that stabbing shot, as Sarah says, the front leg just keeping Kudashova occupied. And it is a good score for Jones. Lands it cleanly and switches it up nicely as well. Well, she was three points down and she's three points up with 30 seconds left. A fantastic atmosphere, of course, in the copper box. Jade Jones firing the headshot in. And we'll get a little chance to discuss her tactics during the break here. But Tatiana Kudashova, well, she hasn't had a chance for a break. Very much on the back foot now, the Russian confidence ebbing away. Likewise, the time. And in terms of a good start from Jones, and she's stymied the interest of Kudashova, looking strong. And a decent round there. A yeah, great round from both athletes, but... Um... I think Kudush over there got potentially a little bit lucky there in the short distance. Um, maybe made Jade think a little bit about what she needs to do um, and refocused. She got a couple of points back up, so I think Jade has the edge a little bit over Kudush shoulder, has that confidence. As you were saying there, Sarah rightly, she's got the edge, she's got the score in front. Let's have a little listen in. Well, hard to hear the instructions. Jade Jones looks confident, no, helped over the barrier. Can she get herself past Kudiana Kudashova here? And the Russian, well, she doesn't have her problems to seek as we go into this second round here. We saw an aggressive start from Jade Jones. I'm guessing we might see similar. She's ready again, you know, straight in the ring, first in the ring, confidence. Nice little spin there by Jade. Unfortunately, no score, but a gam jump for Kudashova for falling over. So a nice little point there for Jones as well. Kudashova falling over. You've started your rhyming already. <laughs> it's started I already. It. It's match one. And she's no match at the moment for that. Kudashova, lovely little push kick again. It's that savage back kick round the corner from Jones. Doesn't land, but gives Kudashova lots to think about. And the cover game of Jade Jones, a little bit underrated, but she's good on the open distance, not so much on the close. Yeah, she struggles. She seems to struggle a little bit in that really close distance when they're nearly chest to chest. Nice push kick over there. Two points and a gum jump for Kudashova. So a comfortable lead for Jones. And a great back kick, good timing. And it is, of course, perfect timing to have the extra point added on for the back kick. So great momentum here for Jade Jones. Tatiana Kudashova, 12 points down. 
Excellent round from Jones. She's really back in form now. She's very, very confident. I think she'll be happy with that lead then going into the third round. Yep, you mentioned on the way into this one. The bronze and the silver, can she turn it into gold? Well, Tatiana Kujo, as you said, left a little space in that close distance. So something to work on, but working on the scoreboard. 19-7 now. As we creep into the last minute of the second round, Jade Jones, the Flint fighter. Well, she's on form now. Jade's not really giving Kudashova anything to work with. She's keeping the pressure on. Still, still in the lead, but still doing what she needs to do to stay in the lead. Well, the Copper Box Arena, the host to this one, semi-final number one. And Jade Jones is number one at the moment, bossing this contest. And Kudashova tries with the back leg. Headshot attempt from the Russian. She's not giving up without a fight to her credit. But Jade Jones, again with that stab, changes it upstairs. Leaves a little gap in the clinch, but she'll learn from that one. Last 10 seconds of an excellent second round. And it's business as usual for Jade Jones. Tatiana Kudashova. Well, she's going to have to go back and try and find a minor miracle here. Second round in favour of Jones and a handsome margin. Yeah, great round for Jones. She'll be happy with that and again, very comfortable going into the last round. I don't really think a tactics will change or should change. Well, it doesn't need to change and you don't need to adjust your eyes. Jones 19, Kudashova 7. Well, here we go, third round, potentially the final round, and there's Tatiana Kudashova can subdue this partisan home crowd. The referee, well, we mentioned she's a former fighter, just checking the gum shields are in. Jones showed up without one in the first round, but she's certainly got her teeth into this fight here. 19-7, a handy lead, Kudashova looking a little bit confused and bemused here on the back foot pushing upstairs good counter there from Kudashova the Russian cuts it to a 10 point game a decent start from the Russian back kick attempt from Jones well blocked from Tatiana Kudashova still Jade Jones starting well Sarah Stevenson big punch there she's doing much better in that short distance she's keeping away with Jot Jones has got that strong right leg and she's got a great spin off the left leg so she's using that to her advantage she might get caught a little bit underneath, but other than that, she's in control, she's comfortable. A nice attempt at headshot by, the, by Kudush over there. No point, but a little front leg twice for Jones there. Kudush over switching off, not covering the shots, and Jones taking advantage. And another attempt at headshot by Jones, but unfortunately no score, but I think she'll be happy with that. Yeah, reasons to be cheerful to Jade Jones here. Thought about trying to cram that one up the stairs, but good blocking from Kudush over. She stayed in the contest, the Russian, and the semi-finals go. A handsome lead for Jones, and she's into the last minute of this third round, and it's going to be the final round. Jay Jones in imperious form here, and she won the Olympic Games not too far from here in the Olympic Stadium in London. Can she go one better? There's a little bit of hook upstairs there. Kudashova saw, as did the ref, Gamge on to play. But it's very much Jones in the ascendancy. It's a difficult situation, the really, really close distance there, so I can totally understand and feel how you can get your arms a little bit tangled, but she seems to be doing a lot better as the day is going on. And time is certainly going on here for Kudashova. Lovely little sh shift in there from Jade Jones. Cuts the distance, has a little fly look at the scoreboard as well, and it makes very good viewing indeed. Into the business end of this semi-final. Jones has a handsome 23-10 lead. Kudashova struggling, overreaching, and it's all over Bala shouting there. Good shot from Kudashova on the inside. The punch from Jones, and she's going to close the door on the ambitions of Kudashova. Another left-handed punch. Both hands in the air. It is Jay Jones into the final. 
deservedly so, and Sarah Stevenson from start to finish, kick perfect. She was brilliant. It's really, really good to see Jay Jones back, and I mean that in every sense of the word. She's looking good, you know, she's looking confident. That win will be a nice boost up for her confidence. It's very, very difficult to find motivation after you've won another Olympic gold. So we were discussing that earlier on at lunch. How do you, I mean, after you talk about the Olympic hangover as you see the confirmation there that Jones is into the final. You win it twice. Yeah. It must be hard to get up the next think, day and yeah, go to training. It's very difficult. I think, obviously, she's never going to want to give away what she's won and everyone wants what she's achieved, which is outstanding. But just to, you, you've won what your dream is twice, what everyone's dream is twice, so it's difficult to find that motivation and she looks like she's there now. She's got the motivation, she's into the final. And here's how she did it.